Your special session gaveled in, then quickly gaveled out. The Republican-controlled Senate and Assembly rejected Democratic Governor Tony Evers' plea for child care funding. This is the 13th time Governor Evers has called a special session that ended quickly inside the Capitol. The governor wants to invest $365 million in child care centers across the state. The Child Care Counts program gave pandemic funding starting in 2020, but that ends this January. GOP lawmakers Makers did not participate in the special session. Governor Evers toured a Fitchburg Learning Center earlier today and reacted to the Republican rejection. Am I surprised? Hell no. Uh, they've been they've been against child care for as long as I can remember, and I'm assuming that uh, that's not going to change anytime soon. Too soon. So we're going to do whatever we can to make sure that we find a different option. Republican Senator Devin Lemahue responded to the special session with a statement saying the child care bill will be referred to committee and, quote, legislative Republicans have long supported workforce development measures that strengthen Wisconsin's economy and create good family supporting jobs. Democrats in the legislature also held a press conference this afternoon. Linda Kundra, the owner of Learning Ladder Preschool and Child Care in Cottage Grove, spoke about how the Child Care Counts initiative has helped the industry as a whole. Child Care Counts has been the life, lifeline for the child care industry. It has allowed us to increase wages, retain... Makes you cry, doesn't it? Yes. <laughs> retain um, educated teachers and our keep, keep our tuition affordable. NBC 15 has been following this story for some time. Last month, we told you the Giggles and Wiggles daycare center in Lancaster is closing. The owner told us they can no longer afford to keep the operation going.